Hello everyone. This is my look for Halloween. It is Witch Muriel from Hansel and Gretel. If you like what you're seeing so far, just stay tuned. Now to start off this look, I moisturized with Nivea Soft all over my face and on my neck. I followed up with Grim 2 Clung up all over my face. You may use a white body paint or a very light foundation on your face if you do not wish to go completely white. I set all of that with powder when I am finished and all over my eyelids I'm going to put a black eyeshadow and I'm going to put it really dark on my lids and under my eyes and then I'm going to blend that out with a fluffy brush and I use the end of the brush I am holding it so that I am not too heavy and this way I would have a smoked out and smudged look when I do this my eyes are going to have more depth and they are going to look more devious I smudge occasionally underneath my eyes with my fingers and with the brush and now I bring it even closer into my nose to contour and to create even more depth for the eyes I am lining my eyes very thin and because of how I did the eyeshadow you would see that it gives my eyes an even devious look. Now keep the line thin if you can and bring it over your nose if you do not have a very slim nose like I don't. And this way it gives the nose a slimmer impression. So basically you're doing a unibrow. Now I'm bringing it down the eyeshadow and I am contouring my nose and I'm going to blend that out with a fan brush. I am also going to contour the tip of my nose and near the nose whole area is like it's a triangle and this way it gives the effect of a pointier nose. Now for the veins or the branches on her head, I am doing very thick ones and very very thin hair like ones. This is very random, I'm not following the picture as much. You just want to make little wides on your face. They don't need to be straight or perfect. Just take your time and you do some big ones and some very hair like ones. And you could even do a few random shapes to change it up. To do this, I'm using a liquid eyeliner. As you can see there, I put like a little crack opening on my face. Now I'm going to continue putting the veins or the branches everywhere and I'm going to carry it down to my neck and the rest of my face. And I will come back when I have that done. Now time to contour the face. I'm using black eyeshadow again. As you can see, I'm holding the end of my brush this way I'm not too heavy with the product I contour my cheekbones and my temples lightly and then I contour 
on my forehead and I am very light and I can gradually build up it is better for me to build up than to correct mistakes especially on white anyway where you want to create more depth you just simply contour and this way you can so here I I'm just flinging my lips with a black lip liner and I'm going over that in the center with a gel eyeliner in midnight blue I line my waterline with Eve Roche eye pencil it's also a type of dark type of midnight blue and I go over it also with my lips to intensify and I put a black mascara on and voila that's the look now I'm going to apply a lace front wig and I'm just going to blend out the lace part with a white eyeliner and that is how I achieve this look thank you all so much for watching I wish you all a happy Halloween and I will see you all next time.